Hey guys, what's up? How do you get one here? And today I'm going to show you how to make a spiral staircase in Google SketchUp. So let's get started. Okay, once you have your template, your blank template, you want to begin by making a circle. Um, you can do this, um, like, you can do, do this in radiuses, which means you can, like, make how big the radius of the circle is. And I'm going to just do about three feet radius, so I'm going to type in three, then one of those commas or whatever, then hit enter. There you go, it makes your D three foot radius circle and you can see your radius is right down here you can also bring this outside for your radius okay now now you want to make a line going from the middle of the radius okay the circle and now you just want to, um, now just make the other parts. Make, and then you want to click and drag it out to another end. Once you have that, you want to push pull that. Um, I'm going to push pull it up about. I don't know, probably about three, five inches, about five inches, which is, if you were looking at my, um, my measurements, you would see, you would see what I'm typing in, and I just made it going down, so, um, anyway, I'm just going to bring it up right about there, that looks good. Now you're going to erase the, the circle outside of the one step. <laughs> you want to start by um, making the bottom, if that was messed up for you. Now this is one of the most important things you do, if anything. You want to select everything. Right click, do make group. Then right click it again, do make component. After that, you're good. Now you want to get the rotation tool and just click from the point of the of your pie, piece of pie. And just it doesn't really matter where you do it on the other side, but before you click and drag, you want to click control, then drag. Drag it. And just drag it. Um, and then you want to make it click to the to make it touch. Now after you have that, it'll be much easier just to do like do um just not keep on doing this for the whole circle. All you have to do is hit um four. I um, think it's about um, four pieces. So you want to hit 7x and hit enter. That's not enough. You want to hit, just like keep on doing it until you think it's it. Then hit x, enter. Nope, probably about 11. So 11x, enter. There we are. That's, that's nice. Now you want to select every single piece of pie. Now you just want to drag it up just a little bit. Just a little bit. Probably about right there would be good. Then you want to do about, I don't know, probably about 5x and enter. I don't think that's enough for so probably about or 7x enter. Uh, 
Oh uh, yeah, let's do about ten. That'd be f that'd be fun. That should be fun. Okay, once you have all your pieces, you want to start by clicking your selection tool and just click, then hit Control on your keyboard and just keep doing what I'm doing. Just click every other step that's on the next level so it'd be kind of like what you see a spiral staircase is like and just keep on doing it until you get get to the end or to the bottom now you want to once you have everything selected hit the a uh, move tool then just hit control again and move that over a little bit. Once you have that, you won't need your your this. You won't need all that. So you can just delete that. Once you have what looks like this, you would want to to make it look realistic, you want to make a structure for the poles, right? For the pieces of pot. So you just push pull it about whatever you think is right is what's good. And you just push pull it all the way up. Maybe a little bit more than the actual top one stops tail stale stare. Oh my god. My speech is not that good. Um well anyway now, this is what comes in handy when you make a component, make everyone a component, is you can actually, it's easy for the rail. I mean, that's like real easy. So, I, I'm not measuring exactly, but I'm just, um, guesstimating, um, what I would like. Then, this this tool we are about to use is called the uh, follow me tool. So first, right now I'm using the line tool, but we are going to make use the other tool. Now you just want to guess the mate. There we are. Now you you can leave it just like the line if you think that's pretty cool but I don't think that's that cool so I am going to push push follow me tool so what you want to do for this to work is you want to get highlight all your lines that you want to push pull it on that line then hit what you call is kind of looks like an um, arrow that's turning like left and has in line on the right going the same direction but it's not the arrow which would be right there if you were to look at my large tool set it's that that tool right there so just click that then you wanna it doesn't that's okay if you don't see your line sliding up anymore but it's okay if you don't see it now if you were to just click outside the component, you would see that you have your staircase. And probably at the bottom, you would want to go ahead and finish that off. Um, now, I like to use glass for this. Like glass, you know what I mean? Or you can just leave it like that, but I don't want to. So... I am going to make a glass thing right here. Okay, fine. I'm going to use the line tool. How about that? Um, just put it right about there. And right about there. Right about there. Right about there. Check this out, baby girl. Why don't you check out a nigga? Yeah, Man, I go to work. True winner. Jean skinny like squirrel. Looking for your girl. Just missed it. Then my cat daddy and I took it down. Timber. 
Red is cold, mama call a winner. Switch it full of niggas, daddy call it dinner. Baby got ass, shorty call it thinner. Hell, that's Remember when I remember. Dark skin is they from rejects. Hell, that's 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 um, please check out my other videos on the desktop and more. Thanks for watching my channel.